Hi everybody, welcome back to Critical Mass. Today we have another random topic. We have our 100 topics in front of us. We're gonna randomly choose one and then we're gonna just talk about it and venture off into everything else except the topic we were supposed to talk about. Yeah, probably. Pretty much guaranteed. So, let's pick one. Now, who's your favorite actor or actress? Duh. <laughs> what? It's too easy. You're Tom Cruise. I am Tom Cruise. Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Your favorite actor is Tom Cruise? I have a man crush on Tom Cruise like you wouldn't believe it. What? Oh yeah. Tom, Cru Tom Cruise and I are bros. Okay, so what if it's not Tom Cruise? Like who's your second? Anybody else but Tom Cruise then. Okay. Somebody else go there. You too, or anybody else but Tom Cruise. Oof. Okay, but you, let's do yours so we can have time to think. Well, I have to think about this too. Okay, well, <laughs> then we'll edit right here right for here. one minute. <laughs> we're we're going to think about who we like other than Tom Cruise. Apparently, we really like Tom Cruise. All right, Mark, you had yours in the top of your head yeah, first. I think uh, Brad Pitt, but not Brad Pitt alone. I like, I really like the way he interacts and has sort of a uh, camaraderie with his co-actors. I think that, uh, that he plays off other people very well. I didn't expect that. I thought for sure you're gonna say Chris Pratt. No, no, no. Yeah. And I knew you were gonna think that I was gonna say that. I like Chris Pratt's movies, uh, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that, you know, I wanna see him see. In, in all the movies. All right. He says Chris Pratt. No, he didn't say Chris Pratt. No. <laughs> Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt. Can you actually name movies that Brad Pitt has been in? Yeah, I like uh, like I liked him in uh, Ocean's Eleven, right? So yeah. and just and just sort of the, the 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 way that he plays alongside of the of his of his co-stars. That's that's what I like about his demeanor. He does it very well. He was good in uh, Fury. He was good in Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Yeah, yeah, that, I I like him too. World War Z. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like uh, how he's able to banter very easily with uh, with his uh, co-stars. He he does do that very well in the Ocean series. Yeah, really well. Okay, what do you got? We're gonna start this here again. We're gonna edit out everything we just did because Paul did a mark <laughs> where he starts talking about somebody who's absolutely the wrong person he was thinking of. He said Russell Crowe. So I'm not the only one who does. It. And we were surprised because I don't know the last time he saw a Russell Crowe movie. But you were actually thinking of Gerard Butler. Gerard Butler, which makes much more sense to me. <laughs> uh, well, they both have accents, right? So, tomato, tomato. There, same guy. Same guy. Same guy. <laughs> One of my all-time favorite movies was Three Hundred. Yeah. I like. We should talk about movies that um, we can't understand why more people don't love them. Okay. Well, because that's, uh, that's a conversation for a different day. Yeah, it might okay. be on. It you. might be on this list. <laughs> but I, I love Three Hundred. I love uh, Olympus Has Fallen and uh, the other London Has Fallen. Those movies. Uh, it's just there's something about him. He is like. He's the alpha male, and I relate to that. <laughs> <laughs> Paul's attracted to the alpha male. You got that? <laughs> okay. I I think. I think alpha male. I think you think it means something <laughs> else. Else. <laughs> this what you're, you're saying. saying. Well, I don't think it means what you think it means. These two words don't line up. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... Okay, who's your second favorite actor? My favorite... Uh, my favorite? My second favorite actor, I would have to go with Ryan Reynolds. Hmm. I, I'm, I'm simply a fan of his humor. He's such a good-natured person, yeah. easygoing. Even his clips that he does on YouTube, like 30 second, 40 second clips here and there are, are outright hilarious. And he has this, this personal demeanor where he's just, I'm Joe everybody. Even, even but, but guess Green what? Green Lantern days? I don't care, he's still. Yeah, I thought he was still good in Green Lantern. Yeah, it's a so it was a story that was bad. But hey, he's Joe everybody, but he looks like that. And yeah. we want to look like that. But he's the kind of guy, I'd like to just go hang out with. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like he's he seems like a fun guy I, just to I would to love to have some of his gin and sit down and have a gin with him. Now what do you mean his gin? He has a gin. Does he? Yeah. Okay. Here here's my question. 
I felt the same thing about Jim Carrey. Will Ryan Reynolds get old? Like, will he just become... Oh, that's it. See, the difference yeah. is Jim Carrey's humor is kind of slapsticky kind of humor. Jim, where Jim Carrey's gone more from comedian to... Uh, I have political... Well, no, 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 but I mean, I mean, even his humor, though, it is a slapsticky humor. It's less of joke. It's less of a Ryan Reynolds humor. Is that kind of comeback, that sly innuendo joke? Um, I'm talking about this, but you know, I mean that. Jim kind of Jim thing. Carrey is is more uh, Jerry Lewis comedy. Same yeah, type of make, make fun of myself comedy. Yeah, so. I, I I don't know. Like maybe Ryan Reynolds is going to be overexposed, and we're just going to get kind of tired of his thing. Well, he he does a lot of different types of movies. He's done romantic comedies with Sandra Bullock. He's done the third wheel person. He's done the, I'm just gonna show up in your random movie as a pop-in star, and, and you're looking at it going, that's hilarious. Mm -hmm. You know what yeah. I mean? No, uh, he's yeah. good, he's good. Uh, so uh, I, when he did that, I you know what? I can't even think of the movie it was at the table when he, oh. Uh, Hobbs and Shaw. Hobbs and Shaw. When he showed up in Hobbs and Shaw, that was the greatest thing ever. That's the only thing I liked in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> like everything else was so over the top and so phony, but that was hilarious to me. He also showed up in a movie where, uh, oh, and uh, Ted, when they go to the party with, um, what's that, the uh, old star from the 50s kind of television show, um, Flash not, Gordon. not Flash Gordon. Flash Gordon. Flash. Flash. Da -da. Yeah, yeah. And he, you know, he, they go to the party, and there's Ryan Reynolds. He just shows up to the guy he's talking to, and he's standing side by side, just holding his hand with his silly smile on his face, <laughs> just, just, just like this. He doesn't say a word in the whole thing. Oh, that's great. But his look on his face, and he's looking like this, and he's smiling. It's hilarious, and it's like a, eight seconds in the movie, and he just randomly shows up in that movie. Yeah, he's good. He's classic. So yeah. Yeah. So I that's win. <laughs> I love that. So we, I think we're all pretty much sure that Russell Crowe is not our favorite. He's he's he's, he's there. He's a great but, guy, but, but he's not. It could be a wonderful stand-in. Maybe. Yeah. Gerard Butler is Gerard <laughs> Butler. Right. Well, well, there you go. Uh, other than Tom Cruise, uh, that is who we think is. Uh, you know, the guy we'd like to hang out with, one of our favorite stars and people we will want to see in movies. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I want to hang out with Gerard Butler. <laughs> <laughs> he might be a dork, I don't know. <laughs> um, Jerry. That's Paul. Yeah. <laughs> when you see him, hit him as hard as you'd like. It's okay, we all do. So, <laughs> that's true. All right, uh, well, let us know in the comments down below who's your favorite actor or actress out there. Uh, is it one of ours, or do you have your own personal favorite? Oh, Tell us why. Yeah. Uh, we could have, I could have easily said Cameron Diaz. I could have said Sandra Bullock. There's all kinds of reasons for some of these stars that would be great actors and actresses. But uh, Ryan's at the top of this game right now, so I have to, have to give it to him. So why not check out some more of our other content down below, and until next time, we'll see you on the channel.